Today we're gonna do what normal people don't do to their ribeye, and we're gonna um, we're gonna cook it like a brisket, and uh, see how that turns out in the smoker. First, we're gonna season it, salt and pepper. First, we're going to uh, just add some salt. We got this thing well coated. Today we're gonna to add some of this cracked pepper on there and it should be delicious. This is what it looks like. We did a uh, coat of peppercorn or cracked pepper. Delicious. So we got it up to temperature here. I put a cup of water into the drip tray um, and we're just gonna close it up and see what happens. See it's at 200 degrees in there. It's gonna get up to 250. Got a nice little flow of smoke coming out. Down at the bottom, we got it open just a little bit. We'll see if it stops at about 250. The temperature creeped up a bit. I have the whole bottom shut and the top is mostly shut. We're gonna check out and see what's going on there. That's what it looks like. It's been about an hour and a half for about four hours now, three hours and 47 minutes. This is what it looks like. looking pretty good it's a, about 260 degrees in here so we're just checking it out right around the edge here it should be tasting good we had it on for five hours and I just took it off and now it's resting so I'm gonna just let that rest inside for a little bit and uh, we're gonna see what it looks like in a few. So I brought in the, I brought in the ribeye, and this is what it looks like. So we're gonna see if it breaks apart like I planned. Doesn't look like it is. We're gonna have to cut it and see. The fat looks really good though. Just get it on a cutting board. So that's not exactly how I wanted it, but it is pretty delicious and it does come apart. Like, Cause it's not so fatty. We'll feed it to the wife. It turned out pretty good. It's tasty. It's a little dry. Probably not the best cut of meat to do this with. The bone was delicious. And uh, there were some other good parts. This is just a little dry. 